Yamio Sinbejo appoints news aide. Abdulrahman Bafayola joins Osin Bejo's team as special assistant on intergovernmental affairs to the acting president. Colleagues of Abdulrahman Bafayola describe him as a patriot and a youth who is active in national politics. The acting president Yemi Osin Bejo will meet with traditional rulers from the northern states on Monday evening, June 19. Acting President Yemi Osin Bejo has appointed Abdulrahman Bafayola as his special assistant on intergovernmental affairs. Osin Bejo's news aide is described as a patriot and a youth who active in national politics by some of his colleagues who celebrated his appointment. Yusuf Galatamale, a friend of the new aide in a Facebook post, described the appointment of Abdulrahman Bafayola as a clearance to Nigerian youths in particular to participate in building Nigeria. He said, that, we are all hopeful of leading Nigeria one day one day. Youth are beginning to see some changes and development in themselves, just within a week. It is truth and a real plus, that youths, have given chances to start in the presidency. This to me, is also a good opportunity for the youths to showcase their hidden talent in building and strengthening the relationship between the old and the young Nigerian, by ensuring good things done. Abdulrahman Bafayola has been described as a patriot by his colleagues. Meanwhile, the acting president Yemi Osin Bejo is scheduled to meet with traditional rulers from the northern region of the country as part of his effort to douse the tension generated by a quit notice issued to Igbos living in the north. The presidency said on Sunday, June 18, that the meeting between the acting president and the northern traditional leaders would take place on Monday evening, June 19. Nage. Com recalls that the acting president has been holding series of meetings with leaders of thought from both the northern and eastern parts of the country following the ultimatum. The acting president has also warned that those agitating for secession in the northern groups that issued ultimatum to Igbos risk jail terms as they violated Nigeria's laws. <laughs>